As a safety speaker, have you ever considered using YouTube to make your safety meeting more fun and your presentation more effective? Uh, and by the way, that's a challenge in this keeping things entertaining or fun. There's some great stuff out there on the internet, on YouTube and other places like that, little videos you can pick up that are fun. If you go on my webpage, there's a great video on fall protection. It's the new standard in fall protection for staircases. And we came out with it, coincidentally, right around April, because we wanted our clients and anybody else that wanted to, to be able to use it on April Fool's Day. Because what it is, is my son-in-law and Sandy climbing up and down the staircase with a full fall protection harness while I am announcing the new government standard for fall protection in the United States, being that uh, if you go up a staircase that has more than three steps, you must have a full fall protection harness on going up and down the stairs. And it's got them tying off onto the rail, going up and down. And, and you know, and I, I, I played that for one company, and they said, oh, we can't wait to use this. The employees will all be sitting there going, are you serious? Because they believe it, you know, right? So, um, and, and they have a good time with that. So uh, anyway, uh, so we came out with that around April 1st, and uh, that's still on the website, so you can pick that up and play it anytime you want. It's uh, staircase fall protection. There's some terrific stuff out there that you can play to me. And there's some stuff you can't use. You have to check to see if it's appropriate. Some of it is clearly not appropriate, and, and keep that in mind. You know, scan over it and ask yourself, okay, is there anybody here that that's offensive to? And, and double check, um, and, and that's, that's worth doing. But there is some fabulous stuff out there on the internet, some incredible creativity, and some things that you could do if you wanted to. One location I was speaking at had a wonderful um, deal where they, they, they had a little safety parody for the fun of it. They had a worker sitting at his desk, and this tells you how old this is. He got out a thing of whiteout, right? He's talking, think in terms of generational things. Most there, is there anybody in this room that wasn't around when you used typewriters? Probably a few, there's a couple of you younger than, yeah, so, yeah. I mean, typewriters, you used to type something, and then somebody came up with this thing called liquid paper or whiteout. What you would do is, you'd paint over on the paper with the color white up that the paper was, and then you'd retype it and save you having to retype a whole page. And, um, and so that, that story now, this video that they made is totally irrelevant and nobody would get it anymore, but the, the guy's actually sitting there at his desk and he's about to use the white out on the paper and he looks at it and he goes, I wonder if this is safe. And so you see him at high speed walking from his office around to the safety department. Next thing you know, he's sitting at the desk with the typewriter, with a respirator on, safety glasses, super big gloves and everything else as he's painting the paper because of the liquid paper being a hazard.